oh my gosh the minute I put on the video, you hear that horn? Ready, set, go. This is gonna be a deck collection review of all the Archangel decks. It's come up in the comments that people wanna see some Archangel decks. So I pull 10 plus decks that I have in my collection. Some of them are newer decks that I'll show you and then also oldies but goodies. So the oldies but goodies are ones that are probably out of print at this point, but you can get your hands on an original or unfortunately or fortunately, they're remakes that you know they're not making them anymore so whatever you can get your hands on right um so they're oldies but goodies and some newer decks but these are all archangel decks so whether it's tarot or oracle connecting higher to archangels having archangels running through them and so it was easy to run around when i was asked to do this in the comments to run around and pull 10 plus decks so we're going to quickly go over 10 plus plus decks that cover archangels and i do have some more but these are the ones that are my top you know top ones covering the archangels and i'll put them all listed in the description box of this video also on my channel, if you're new here, I do have a playlist that covers all the close-up reviews. If you want to see every card and every deck I have shown on the channel, I have a close-up review playlist that shows close-up reviews of Tarot and Oracle decks. And I also have another playlist that shows deck collections, where this is going to be in the deck collection playlist, all the deck collection videos that I've done. And the third thing is on my website, I've now put all the collection videos and close-up reviews in alphabetical order because on YouTube it's not, and I'll put my website, that section where the close-up reviews are in alphabetical order in the description box also, so all in one place. But I couldn't wait to do this and take a break of work because when well, the world's driving you crazy and everybody in it, I always find connecting with decks is like the best escape. So, okay, let's get right into it. I'm gonna show you first some newer Archangel decks and then we'll go into the oldies but goodies and added, I added in a bonus one also. Um, I wanna get right into which one should I get into? Let's do Alana Fairchild. She came out recently with a deck, Angelic Lightwork Healing Oracle Night. It doesn't glaringly say Archangels, but you are connecting with the Archangels in here. That's the whole purpose of the deck, and it's all Archangels. So def definitely, it's healing magic and manifestation, see, with the Archangels. And even though it's not in the title, it is an excellent deck to connect with the Archangels. So it's weird how it's this way, but it's Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Uriel. This is all to really tap in with the energy. Now, if you're familiar with Alana Fairchild, she really goes in depth with her guidebooks. So this is one where it's a gorgeous deck, but you're gonna wanna go into that guidebook because it's channeling messages to really connect. Look at that. We keep on getting about boundaries, enhanced protection for beautiful boundaries. You're you're going to get a beautiful message and almost like a channeling and how to connect with Archangel Raphael. Each card is a, is attributed to an Archangel and how to really connect. I mean, with a prayer and everything else. And I got to tell you, with the close-up review, you know, I do close-up reviews plus a bonus, bonus reading at the end, reading from the guidebook. But what happens is you really feel a shift in your energy when you're reading this and with the cards. You just do and you just are you're transported you feel more connected and your energy definitely changes so with this deck I believe and it comes with a stand also where you can put your cards and if you want to you know if you're one of those that like to put it up on an altar and look at your card you can just put it in the stand here like this um I just want to see how many cards are in here because it's not really saying <laughs> Hold on a second. I think there's like 48 cards in here. Um, oh my gosh, how many cards are in here? It doesn't even say, I think it's 48. Hold on, 44 cards. Okay, 44 cards in here. Yeah, 44 cards and it goes to mother healing. I love that. A message of restored sense of self and finding our place, our innate spiritual belonging and value within ourselves. Wow, just be, it's so beautiful, Archangel Uriel. I'm telling you, you're gonna get lost. 44 cards, okay. So these are the, they're also the spectacular gold, uh, mustardy kind of gilding on these cards, and these are the backs of the cards. 44 cards to connect with the Archangels. And it will have all these beautiful, colorful pictures of light that the more you look at the cards, the more things leap out. 
within the images. So emotional comfort, I'm just gonna go through very briefly. And again, you know, you wanna see the close-up reviews. I have those, but just to give you an overview, it's just really beautiful. Past life, present power, recovery into grace, beautiful light infused messages. I love this card, soul love. And you're gonna, I, like I said, you're gonna wanna go in and um, connect with those archangels and read the channeled messages because you're really transported and you definitely feel a connection and you definitely feel your energy shifting. I, I don't know what else to say about it. Finding what was lost, it's really beautiful. I break through into light, soothing mind and spirit. That's what I feel like I'm doing right now. You really feel transported, reconnected. Um, it's just gorgeous light images. Your heart is a healer. Yeah, it's just really, really beautiful. I love this card. Cultivating ease and grace. Yeah, so I won't go through every card, but it is a gilded deck. It does come with a stand, 44 cards. This is Angelic Light Work Healing Oracle from Alana Fairchild. Exactly what I said. Like, you're going to want to go in here and connect with the healing magic and manifestation it's attributed to whichever card it's going to be a different archangel you're going to have a prayer to connect and it's just beautiful um and, and visualizations as well um it's just really really beautiful your heart is a healer i mean it's just really a gorgeous gorgeous deck to connect with the archangels and if you want to specifically connect with archangel michael raphael G archangel gabriel uriel and these beautiful light images um this newer deck from uh, Lana Fairchild is just really gorgeous. It's one of my favorite decks from hers, and that's saying a lot because she's come out with a lot, but it's really, really beautiful. Artwork from Daniel B. Holman. Oh, yes, Daniel B. It's gorgeous artwork accompanying it. Okay, so that's her. The next one I want to show too, one of my ultimate favorites, quickly became my top favorite, was Archangel Fire Oracle from Alexandra Wenman. 40 cards in here and a guidebook. And I love this guidebook so much because there's a section that says become the angel, become the archangel. Oh my God, it's just, I have chills. It's gorgeous, gorgeous. And you're going to want to go in this guidebook. So say for example, Azrael transitions, there's the message you're at a major point of transition. It will describe the archangels. There's a lot of archangels in here I was not familiar with. You're going to find that in these 40 cards. Um, how to meet Azrael. What's the diamond fire here? Alchemy, celestial soul bridge, become the angel. And this part is just so beautiful. Yes, yes, yes. I mean, just the tone of this is just amazing. When you find yourself in a transition or facing a shift in your circumstances or energy, call in Israel to soothe the way for you, smooth the way for you, and imagine his wings lifting you above any stress so you may arrive smoothly to the other side staying in the energy of trust can help ensure the highest outcome for you yeah we kept on getting at ensuring trust 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 but you're going to want to go into look archangels of the gold ray archangels of the silver ray um turquoise ray it's broken out like that the pink ray a shanuel love and relationships how to meet the archangel um i just love how it describes the alchemy here and then become the angel um, to become the earth angel open your heart to greater love so you may heal all aspects of your life and relationships it goes on it's just absolutely stunning okay so these are the cards 40 cards in here this is a newer deck as well um so this is archangel fire i love that the fire is like giving you that energy and here are all these archangels beautiful images we got this card the last time we did a reading on the channel um sophia so funny about love because this is all about love and compassion but some of these you're not going to be familiar with and it's just really amazing and the messages are so deep i love this card they're so deep again you're going to want to go in that guidebook and you really deeply connect and i love that part with become the angel because you almost feel like infused with their energy i love how it's even called archangel fire like infused with that energy and that's what you feel a shift so i feel like those two um, Archangel decks, you really feel a shift in your energy or a real connection. Um, yeah, it's just a real, real connection and shift. This is on the cover, Ariel. I just love this so much. So I won't go through every card, but 40 cards in here. And you do feel a shift and you connect deeply. So those two were, I just love, love, love. Um, another deck that was uh, recent was from Diana Cooper. 
And here is a new deck Archangel Oracle. So I believe 44 cards in here. And she has a slew of decks as well, you know. So this is the backs of the cards. This is one of my lockdown treats when I did a deck collection video. Um, here in this guidebook, you're going to want to go in here. Archangel Faith. With faith, you're invincible. Believe in yourself. So this is Archangel Michael Connection and the Guidance. And it's really, really gorgeous. Lady Gaia. Your challenges are lessons. You're loved and welcome on earth. And so you're going to go into the detail of the Archangel and the guidance message. So I, I just love the Archangel Mariel. Manifest for the highest good. Work with pure love. And then you have the guide, the description and the guidance. So it's just really gorgeous. And she has a lot of great decks that are very high frequency also. But this is the backs of the cards. These are not gilded. These are 44 cards in here. And you'll have keywords right on the, on the bottom here too. You have 44 cards. So this is the top of the deck. And in here, you'll have Archangel Faith. And it will say with faith, we keep on getting this, flipping to this. With faith, you are invincible. Believe in yourself. So there's a lot of colorful. This is more colorful images, contemporary artwork, more um, see with enlightened eyes, open to abundance. Very colorful. Carry the violet flame. It's time for a transmutation. Guardian angel, love yourself unconditionally. Ask for help. These are very gentle, colorful images. Act with wisdom. Use information for the highest good. So you can use your intuition right away with just here. Welcome new beginnings. Let the sun shine in your life. and um, Or you can dive into the guidebook for more messages. Stand in your power. Be true to yourself. Yeah, it's a recurring message. Purify your life with love. Prepare for something better. I love that. Yeah, so these are beautiful. These are just beautiful cards to, to get lost in. And the artwork's stunning. It's very colorful. And again, like you can use your intuition and the keywords are right here. Give with an open heart. Be generous. Yeah, and so, and you can dive into the guidebook also. And this is the Archangel Oracle. Not to be confused with the older Archangel Oracle cards, which I'm going to show you also. Um... Maybe we should just dive into that one. Okay, the older Archangel, I call this the newer one, and you'll see that in the description box of this video. This is the newer one from Diana Cooper. One of the first Archangel decks that I got was from Doreen Virtue. This is one of the older ones that are out of print, but I'll put the original link down if you find a remake, that's fine. I mean, they're not making them anymore. This is 45 cards in here. I remember when I got this card, um, uh, got this deck it was so many years ago and this was just so so gorgeous I love this deck I keep this in a special spot this is not gilded this is the original Archangel Oracle cards and 44 cards in here 45 45 cards so here and their keywords right here and the message from the Archangel is right here so you have passion Archangel Haniel trust and follow your renewed passion in your love life and career Go, go, go. That's a recurring message for right now. Compassion. So the Archangel's here and the message, it's right on the cards. This is what I love these older decks for, it, like with the messages right there. Gifts from God. Archangel Sandalfon. We angels bring you gifts from your creator. Open your arms to receive. Career transition. Hello from heaven. Archangel Azrael, your loved ones in heaven are doing fine. Let go of worries and feel their loving blessings. Beloved one. They're just beautiful. Remember who you are, Archangel Michael. You are a powerful, loving, creative child of God. You are very loved. These are old, what I call oldies but goodies, clear sentience. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Notice your recurring physical, emotional feelings as they signify divine guidance. Yeah, this was like one of my very, I mean, I loved this deck. I mean, it's tried and true. I would never get rid of it. Moon cycles, it covers everything. Spread your wings. I remember when I used to do readings for myself, I would take a picture of the readings. I gave that as a tip on my channel to people. Um, in the old days before we really did channels and all this stuff, like I took pictures of my readings. So I remember the cards. And then I this one I put on my refrigerator. So I remember this image. This came out in one of the readings. Spread your wings, Archangel Ariel. Do not hold back right now. The timing is perfect and you are ready to soar. So beautiful. They're all angelic um, images, overcoming difficulties, 
yeah, it's just really, really beautiful. So all is well. Let me end it here because victory. I can just keep going. I love these cards so much. Archangel Oracle cards, 45 cards. This is one of the original. So it's out of print, but you could maybe find an original or a remake or whatever they're doing right now. Okay, so this is what I call the older one. That's the newer one from Diana Cooper. Another newer one, so let's stay with the newer ones. Another new one, you would not think it's connected to the Archangels, but it is. Inspire, Change, and Healing, Divine and Crystal Vibration Oracle Cards. Now, I love this. This is going from, to her original website, her direct website, which I'll put in the description box. What I love about it, it combines my favorite things, Archangels and Crystals. So when I saw this, and I don't know how I found it because I was guided to her personal channel and it, I don't know it's one of those things like you have no idea how you got there but you knew the deck is for you it comes with a very little um booklet here you're not even going to need it you're not going to this is one of those guys but you're not really going to need to go into here at all I love first of all silver gilding so I love you know I love that um how many cards are in here I think they're 44 yeah 44 cards in here and this is from Cindy Smith and I'll put her description in the description box her direct website I love the angel wing heart image back here silver gilding which is had me at hello and here so memory here's the archangel message here then you're going to have the crystal message the action to take and the affirmation i love that i mean i just love that so, and here it's a picture of the crystals that actually feel like real crystals you know it's not just a drawing archangel metatron me message shields yourself the fluorite message that's the name of the crystal the type of crystal the action affirmation I mean, it's just amazing. Pay attention to your thoughts. You're going to have the Archangel associated, the crystal, the action to take in the affirmation. This is one of my favorite decks to combine, seriously, the Archangels and the crystals. I was like, oh my gosh. Maintaining your chakra centers. This must be Selenite. Yep. Selenite message, the Archangel Michael message, action, affirmation. I just love that so much. I love the messages on here. I love that you're connected to the Archangels. This, you are protected. Archangel Michael message. My child, ask for clearing and protection. And so it is. Divine white light creates a vibration to stop all negative intent. Consider this white light protection as a block to stop all harm. This is black tourmaline message. Herkimer diamond message, because there's two crystals here. The action and the affirmation. Yes, yes, yes. I mean, it's just really really beautiful remove old grief i love what it covers too joy is your life purpose yes i choose to follow the path of joy now this is archangel michael again my child joy is a high vibration emotion at all times when you experience joy you have created your life's journey your life purpose equals joy your life path is on track when you are creating joy. It goes on. You know, it's just, I just love, love, love. Finish what you start. And I love these crystals that are so, like, real crystals. Speak your truth. Archangel Gabriel, recurring message. My child, your truth is equal in respect to others' truth. Your worth of communication is equal. It goes on and on and on. Motivation and action. Yeah, so I can get lost in here. I'm just giving an overview. Time to play. I love that. If forgiveness. It's just beautiful. Life is great. Archangel Raziel, clear courts message. I am proud of my success now and in my future. I allow change with ease. It's just gorgeous. And I just love these Archangel messages and the crystal message. Again, Archangel Michael, stop overwhelm. Yeah, I am in the now. It's just, it just really is a great connector, self-love and respect. Yes, Archangel Jophiel. I am open to receive divine love and hold it within. I allow my light to shine bright for all to see. We'll end it with that. But I just love, so this is Inspire Change and Healing and Gilding and it's gorgeous and it's her direct website. It's 44 cards, but you wouldn't know that it connects you with the archangels, but it does and crystals. On that note, I'm going over to here, our older cards that I had that I still love, Archangel Gemstones. Talking about connecting with the archangels and crystals. I bought all three of hers because I couldn't decide. I remember when I was going through that. She has, a, this is all Margaret Ann Lambeau. I'll only show you the Archangels. It's similar format for all of them. Um, 
the angels and gemstones, masters, mystics, and saints, and gemstones, and the archangels. So what I like about it is it's connecting you. All of these are very similar format, and I think they all have 44 cards in here. Um, yeah, 44 cards. So I'll show you this one, and it's all the same. But see how you can't decide, because this connects you with the angels and gemstones, masters, mystics, and saints, and this is the archangels. So archangels, so you're going to have what I love about this, and it's right on, there's no guidebook. It's right Right on the cards. I always did the crystals first. So say you have quartz crystals. This is your quartz crystal message here. Are you ready to meet the love of your life? Reignite your connection with your partner, this kind of thing. And we'll, here's the archangel message right here. I attract healthy, harmonious relationships into my life. So that's what it is. It's on one side, it's the crystal, archangel Michael. So you have Malachite. I always did this part first. What patterns in your life do you keep repeating? And it's a whole message. And here's the Archangel Raphael. I find balance within. I feel my feelings and embrace my emotions in this whole beautiful message. So I loved that it was like the crystals on one side. I don't know how to, yeah. It was like these gorgeous crystals on one side. Are you in search of a deeper spiritual connection? And here is Archangel Sandalfin. I am aligned with the four elements in the four directions. It will align you. Um, look at how beautiful these are. Are you in love? Are you craving health and feelings of well-being? This is Archangel Jophiel. I activate and embrace divine love. My emotions are balanced and clear and joyful. Um, you know, it's a whole message from your... So you could shuffle the cards, see what crystals come out, and what are the messages for the from the crystals and then the archangels. I'm grateful that my vital life force provides me with the energy, motivation to live life to the fullest. Financial abundance is mine. My connection with the divine is alive and well. I'm energized, healthy, and strong. Yeah, it's just it's just beautiful. Oh, I love this crystal. Are you looking for inspiration? Archangel Jophiel, I'm calm and at peace with myself. And it's like you connect with the archangels, Archangel Lapis Lazuli. Are you listening to your inner guidance? And it will be a message from Archangel Michael. I'm focused. I see, sense, feel, and know the truth. I follow my intuition. I, I receive messages all the time and follow my internal, internal guidance. So I just love this because it's crystals on one side and then the archangels on the other. So this is the archangels and gemstones. And like I said, this is 44 cards, but then you also, why I got carried away is this is now the masters, mystics, and saints, and this is the angel gemstone. So I used to do readings with all three, like um, let's get answers from the angels and our gemstones, archangels, and the masters, mystics, and saints. It was very, very cool. The next one I want to show, similar to this where you have to go to a direct website, you know, I'll put where you can get all the decks. Um, some are from, you know, wherever you want, but some of these are direct websites. So this one I love. And thank you there and back again. Because she was the one that told me about this and directed me to her, uh, another person's website. The website for Kimberly Dawn. So there and back again, I thank you so much. Because this really added to my life, these cards. I love them for like a quick connection to your archangels. So you go directly to her, Archangels Bless. Uh, her name is Kimberly Dawn, who created this. It's there and back again on my channel, who um, told me in the comments, go to her because you're going to love these cards. She had them herself and she thought of me. And yes, yes. Okay. So here, hallelujah. Beautiful. These are all beautiful images here. And here are the archangel messages right on the cards. I love things with the messages right on the cards. <laughs> I'm very much like no nonsense direct hit me with the hit me with your best shot right a, a quick shot of spirit is what I always say a quick spirit pick me up hallelujah this is the archangel Michael message you are celebrated for having the courage to show up and ask for help each day we know it's not easy here you're a courageous soul and we're cheering for you assisting you every step of the way do you have chills all through your body because I do I feel like I just got bathed so here's the connect to the truth that in the end no matter what, you've already won. You've made it. And celebrate the magical feeling of celestial celebrations that are happening for you. Is that beautiful? So I won't read every card, but creativity, you'll have Archangel Gabriel message this time. Connect to you and celebrate. And the tone of the messages, I mean, I don't know if you felt that running through you, but I certainly did. And that's what it feels like, a jolt of spirit, a quick shot of spirit, a spirit pick me up. Everything that I keep doing, like those spirit pick me up readings, it feels like that. Archangel Michael, 
message and celebrate. I, I just love this so much, DNA healing. So this will quickly connect you to the energy, right? Stand strong, Archangel Michael, again, allow peace to reign in your heart. Just when I said I felt I felt rained on, call upon me to clear away any strongholds that cause you to feel worth wobbly at times. I am with you, helping you see through the distortion so that your strength continues to take firm root. I mean, I love the tone of that message totally resonates with me. Connect to knowing your inner strength comes from healing what's ready for release. Celebrate how much you have freed yourself up. Stand strong, free will, setting boundaries, exploring, friends. You know, it's beautiful. Triumph, Archangel Metatron. When you look back on your life, you'll know your fortitude was blessed from day one. Every struggle and triumph brought gifts. Is that just beautiful? Easier life, aha moment nature connection yeah i mean it's just i feel my energy shifted already life purpose a better world archangel michael we are smiling with you today for a better world is ahead of you let your light shine dear one the journey remembered will be worth it connect to trusting your instincts even when others want something different from you celebrate knowing how well you're guided in the etheric realms and here you're not alone you're not alone. I mean, yeah, I mean, it, like, I have chills. You get tears in your eyes. This is Archangel Oracle Cards for Goddesses. She also calls it for Goddesses and Empaths. This is her direct website. Thank you there. I'm back again for recommending me go there. But that's the Archangel Oracle Cards. Like, you really connect. Another deck that you're going to know and see forever on my channel is the Archangel Power Tower Cards. For some reason, the minute this is re-released with um, Radley Valentine. Um, this is a tarot deck to connect with archangels. And ever since I got it, I tend to use this over my other tarot decks. And I have a slew of tarot decks. But for some reason, and you see that on my channel, I use these decks, all this deck all the time. And I think it's because it's connecting to that energy. I thought you can go in the guidebook. I don't, but you can. And we'll give some of the majors are renamed. And all of the suits are renamed. So it's like the swords are Michael, right? Um, the cups are, well, uh, the pentacles are Ariel, um, the cups are Raphael, um, and Gabriel is the bronze, you know, but there's something about this that when I got it, it was gold gilding. <laughs> it was, but it's been worked on. I mean, this is like my deck that I use all the time in the channel. It's usually when I'm doing readings for everyone or the archangels were going higher, like for readings on my channel, for those that stop by, it's like always connecting higher to that overall energy and overall messages. And there's something about this that ever since I got it, it was like my deck. And fortunately or unfortunately, I mean, all my other decks that I loved before are kind of like on the side because I tend to go with these. There's something about it. <clears throat> I instantly resonated. Another thing I recommend this deck too is you can be a complete beginner to tarot and the messages are right there on the card so you don't even have to know tarot at all. All the suits are renamed for Archangel, like I said, the Archangels. Very easy to follow. I love even the tone of the majors. Um, you know, the hangman is called Perspective. The Empress is the Empress. Okay bad example but <laughs> some of these you know like they're renamed so it's it's not like death or tower change your life instead of the tower it's just um a more sensitive a better more positive way of looking at it that it's a life experience and you know death is not death it's something else you know it's just so here, our Eight of Gabriel, it will say a great deal of activity, sudden immediate results, important communication. So this is the Eight of Wands, but it's now named the Eight of Gabriel. And there's something about it, plus all the images are angelic. So King of Michael, this of course is the King of Swords, but this is an angelic. And then the keywords for the suits are up here for the court cards. And here's the message right here. So it you can do a reading, whatever level you are. The purples are all majors. And... There's something about this because I feel like it incorporates the Archangel message behind the suit. I know that sounds really weird, but like let the force of Archangel Michael, when it's propelling you to take action, feel back like that love support backing. You know, um, like I said, like I didn't learn cards. I felt more connected to spirit first. So when I started buying Tarot and Oracle cards, I was looking for that tone of spirit in my decks. I know that sounds really weird. Most people have learned Tarot and they're buying decks on that. But I, that's not where I came from, um, like naturally. That's not where I was. So I look for spirit in my decks. I didn't buy, like, look for decks. So I think that's why. I don't know. 
this was in my vein, this was in my tone, and everybody's different, so that doesn't mean that this might be right for you, but for me, and so I find people gravitate to what speaks their tone, speaks their language, what they feel connected to already, and then the card works within your vein, so to speak, so this was just so in my vein, so having the angelic pictures in here, that it's the archangels, the messages right here, yeah, something happened, um, it just clicked, and I use this. I also like using this for other people, when I do readings with other people because they can follow along and see where I'm getting my information. <laughs> so sometimes I go off on a tangent and it's like they can follow what's happening and because it says it right here, they understand and it's like visually they get it, what's happening also. It's not like a vague picture and they almost feel the energy too, you know? So I really love this deck. I can't say enough about it. So this is the Archangel Power Tarot card. So if you want to connect with the Archangels when you're doing a tarot reading, I loved using this deck. I love, love, of love um yeah i mean i just do and it's very easy to read and i and also some of radley valentine's decks you know they're all color coded they all have messages on the cards but some of them are organized by seasons or some are organized but you know these are organ renamed by archangels and that i got too like I, it just yeah i love and i love the backs of the cards i'm a, a back of the card lover i love the backs of the cards and i love the gilding that was on this deck <laughs> so these are out i mean these are new and you know these were an old deck but it's still out and being released in archangel power tarot so if you're looking for a tarot deck so then the last three that I want to show are older decks, the ones that were out of print, but Archangels that are just old Doreen Virtue decks, like tried and true, along with this Archangel Oracle that I love this deck from her too, Archangel that has all the or Archangels in it, but then she did individual ones with Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael, and Archangel Gabriel. So I'll quickly show you those. They all have 44 cards in them. These are the original out of print ones, but they're remaking them. Uh, you know, they might not look like this because they're remakes or you can pay a little bit more and still get an original somewhere. But um, these are the Archangel tried and true that came out years and years ago. The Archangel Michael, the originals look like this, right? So you have a guidebook and they're just beautiful black and white pictures. Forgive yourself, you've done nothing wrong. And it will have this whole Archangel mes Michael message and the prayer to connect with Archangel Michael, fabulous. Backs of the cards have him down here, Archangel Michael. And these were gold gilding. This is the original, right? Out of print. And this was what it looked like. So I don't know if this is, the remakes are looking like this, but take your time making this decision. And here's Archangel Michael, and you have the direct here message prayer. And it's all my prayer. Archangel Michael, please help me stay strong and relaxed as I approach the situation and all this, like a prayer. The situation is already resolved. It just felt like strength. Um, it just was the energy of strength, love, support. You can't make this up. Support. Lean on God and the angels for support. That's what it felt, um, this, this sense of humor. Forgive yourself. You've done nothing wrong. My prayer, I ask that you help me let go of self-blame and forgive myself. Please guide me, releasing any toxic anger or fear toward others. Thank you, Archangel Michael, for allowing me to feel centered and at peace. Very angelic images. Write about your thoughts and feelings. Your home is protected. Archangel Michael, thank you for watching over my home. Yeah, it was all these prayers to connect really deeply with Archangel Michael. Self-respect, dear God and the angels, thank you for helping me to see myself as you see me. Oh my goodness, you know, it's like that. It's really, really wonderful. Shield yourself, eternal love, believe and trust. Yeah, it's, you created the situation and you have the power to change it. You're on the right path. Archangel Michael, I call upon you now. Thank you for giving me loud and clear guidance that I easily understand. Have confidence, guarded and protected. You and your loved ones are safe. Okay, I'm gonna end it here, but you can, you get the feeling. So it really connected you with the backing, the strength, stamina to, to move on, the Archangel Michael to feel supported. Archangel Gabriel was more for work, right? Work projects, that's the um, 44 cards in here. Again, it's gonna be gold gilded cards. I didn't, I didn't really go into these guidebooks, but yeah, well, black and white uh, pictures, keep going, the messages here, but it's right on the card, so you don't really have a need to go in there. Gold gilding, these are the backs of the cards, Archangel Gabriel, 44 cards, and success, congratulations, you did it. Very angelic, almost older artwork in this deck, Re recognition, you and your accomplishments are receiving appreciation and honors, gratitude, this is more work-oriented, your projects, 
Pay attention to your dreams. Law of attraction. Keep your thoughts positive. Surround yourself with positive people, situations. You will attract more positivity in your life. Let go. Media. Mother Mary. Listen only to love. Don't allow fear to distract you from your divine mission. Open your heart to love. Nurture yourself. Investing time in self-care now will yield more energy for you new project so this is very helpful when it came to projects and your work and feeling backed in that way keep going use the energy of any disappointments to fuel your creative project with authentic emotion have confidence in your creations trust in the power of god's creativity which is being manifested through you yeah i mean there was really really beautiful support for like your work and everything. I mean, these were like such great decks. Okay, and the last one I wanted to show you was Archangel Raphael, one of them too. Same format with the little guidebook, but this was the box of the cards. I mean, I just remember doing Archangel readings with these and you can go in here and here's the back of my picture and it has the description, increased energy and the prayer. Dear Archangel Raphael, thank you for filling me with the unlimited energy of divine love and light. Yes, for all of us. Last deck. So here's the gold gilding. This is the backs of the cards. These cards can stay in good shape, I have to say. Expect a miracle. Dear God and Archangel Raphael, thank you for your miraculous intervention and healing energy, which has restored the health of blank. And you could do prayers. You could say yourself or anybody you're concerned about. Forgiveness heals. All of this was such angelic. Do more research. Fresh air. This is all for healing, right? This is all for um all for healing divine intervention dear archangel raphael thank you for loving for for being with blank and for helping with oh you could put in anything it's like blank see you it's a tail you could tailor your prayer i have faith in divine intervention and i fully accept your guidance now avoid allergens acceptance this was all about healing Ask your body for a message, detoxification, good night's sleep, relationship, easy does it, yeah. Increased energy, dear Archangel Raphael, thank you for filling me with the unlimited energy of divine love and light. I feel like that message wanted to be seen. We keep getting that. So that was the Archangel Raphael 44 cards. So these three, yes, they're out of print originals, but you can still get your hands on them somewhere. These three and also the Archangel ones that have all the Archangels in them. The newer ones are behind here and all the other ones are still available everywhere. And I will put it all in the description box, but this was when asked, you know, show some oracle decks that or tower decks that have archangels running through them. This was very easy to pull out, like some of my favorite ones, oldies and good but goodies, and then some newer ones. And if you want to browse for close up reviews or deck collections, I'll put the playlist in the description box too. And yeah, and this has been the deck collection review 10 plus decks. Yeah, it's definitely at least 10 decks uh, covering archangels. Uh, I feel like a different person now. Like uh, it's such a break and escape going through these decks. So this was a lot of fun. And I wish you the best with whatever decks you get and use. Take care. Bye-bye.